people were worshipping stones and sticks and idols and people and so many other things and they had lots of superstition in them. What a blessed gift of Allah. Allah is sending a messenger from amongst them to say worship your maker and your maker alone and do not associate partnership with your maker. <laughs> your Rabb, the one who taught by the pen. He taught man what man did not know. What man did not know. What did man know at the beginning? Nothing. As time is passing, Allah is allowing us to know more and more certain things we will never be able to explain, such as a dream. When you dream, what do you dream? How do you dream? They still have not developed a little flash stick that you can plug into your ear and choose to dream what you would like. That hasn't yet happened. Allahu Akbar. And I don't think it's coming. This is a gift of Allah. You dream, you can be dreaming of the best dream. The person next to you can be having the worst dream. The two of you will be one in peace and the other in torment. When you get up, subhanallah, neither can feel what happened to the other. That's a gift of Allah. Allah says, we taught man what he did not know. That's Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Think of his greatness. And Allah is telling us, And you have not been granted knowledge except but a little. Still, whatever you have is just a droplet. Subhanallah. A long time ago when people used to be told of how the angels write down everything you utter, and it is written and it will come on the day of Qiyamah and it will be weighed on the scales, literally weighing on the scales. People began to say, how will the books look? They will look like this and they will look like that. Today you have a 64 gigabyte little chip smaller than the size of my nail. And in it you can have 6400 libraries full of books and still there will be space. Subhanallah. Look at this. And people used to say, how will that happen? Today when you talk, the computer registers, the iPhone registers, the Android device registers and people wonder how will these angels register? Allahu Akbar. Look, a few years ago it was not dreamt of that your phone will listen to your instruction. Today it's there. Today people speak to the doors. They tell the door to open, it opens with your voice. Anyone else's voice, it doesn't open. You come to the door, it recognizes you by your eye and it opens for you. It's happening. Where do you think you're going to run away from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and His forces? That Rabb who gave us out of the little knowledge that we have, the understanding of so much, do you not think he is able to absolutely have the record of every droplet that has occurred from the beginning of time right to the end of time? Subhana Rabbi Al-A'la.